Competitive inhibitors. Competitive inhibitors bind reversibly at the active site of the enzyme. They compete with the substrate for the binding position. They usually have a chemical structure similar to the substrate. Once they bind to the active site, they do not form products. They just block the active site and make it unavailable to the substrate. In this type of inhibition, Vmax is not changed as there is still a substrate concentration where full enzyme activity can be achieved. However, it takes a higher substrate concentration to reach this rate, therefore Km is increased. So here we have the inhibitor and as you can see it binds to the active site preventing the substrate molecule from doing so. And from this graph we can see that with the competitive inhibitor the Vmax is the same but the Km which is half the value of Vmax would be higher. Non-competitive inhibitors. Non-competitive inhibitors bind away from the active site. This results in a change in the protein's conformation that alters the shape of the active site, inhibiting its ability to bind to the substrate. So here we have the substrate and it binds to the active site of the enzyme. However, if we have a non-competitive inhibitor which binds away from the active site, the shape of the active site is changed so the enzyme cannot bind to the substrate. Increasing the concentration of substrate does not reduce this type of inhibition as the active site is unavailable. Vmax is decreased but the value of Km is unchanged. So from the graph you can see that with a non-competitive inhibitor the value of Vmax has decreased but the value of Km is the same. And here we have a summary. So competitive inhibitor versus non-competitive inhibitor. So the competitive inhibitor binds at the active site, whereas the non-competitive binds away from the active site. The competitive is similar in structure to the substrate. The non-competitive has a different structure to the substrate. With the competitive inhibitor, Vmax is unchanged, whereas Vmax is lowered for non-competitive. Competitive inhibitor, the Km is increased, Non-competitive, no change in Km. And finally, for a competitive inhibitor, increasing concentration of substrate has an effect, whereas for non-competitive, increasing concentration of substrate has no effect.